Where are we going, honey? Going on a date night. Date night. Woohoo! So, Jay made reservations at this restaurant in Portsmouth. It's called Martindale Wharf and it's like overlooking the, I can never say it, Piscataqua. Piscataqua. River. And that goes out to the ocean. So it's a very popular restaurant and sitting on the, the decks is um, sometimes really hard to get on the decks, right? I mean, you need to have the reservation Saturday. Yeah, there's like three or four different restaurants on that deck. Uh, so you just have to kind of walk across and go through each restaurant. <laughs> but we have reservations. So, so anyways, we'll we got this gift certificate from Justin and Tamara, right? Yeah. I don't even know how long we've had this gift certificate. We've had it for quite a while. So a few years. <laughs> three years. Probably. <laughs> I think we, we held on to it because we were hoping that Justin and Tamara would be come out back. here yeah. and we'd spend it with them because we took them there yeah. when they did come out here. So we thought it'd be kind of cool to be able to, um, to do that. Oops. What's going on here? They should. We just got rerouted. Uh, oh my gosh. It was a white bag, body bag in the road. It must have been an accident. Either that, I didn't see a car. Did you see a car? I, probably a motorcycle. Oh my gosh. How awful. So it was now we're going to be rerouted and we're going to go through Exeter to get to Portsmouth. I hope we still, well, we're going to do fine because we, we left early because we're going to go to um, beach. We're going out to the beach. We're going out to Newcastle. We wanted to to uh, go to the spot where we had um, spread dad's ashes. So every time we, we go out to this particular spot, we think of dad and we, we say a couple of words for him. So anyways. So we got the gift certificate, like I said, from Justin and Tamara. We were hoping that they would come out and be with us. And we would we would uh, take them out with us. But finally decided we're just going to do it on our own. So we've got a very sort of romantic date night. Cause well, I think the thing you have to realize, too, it is 75 degrees right now here in New Hampshire on the fifth day of November, which is unseasonably warm. Which is amazing. Amazing. So we've had... We've actually been pretty blessed this week with weather, although I've been totally crazy at work and so have you, so we haven't been able to enjoy it. But we did, um, Jay is going to share with me a clip that I'm going to include in here so that you guys can see it. When we did the Cape Cod Rail Trail, we went off the rail trail and we went down to this little harbor, right? It was like a little harbor town and it was... It was so easy to get to. Your the trail kind of goes along the water, and so we were able to just take a quick right hand turn, and we were right there at a small little harbor. Do you remember? Yeah. And we sat there, and Jay took his drone out, and he flew the drone. So I'm gonna in, superimpose some of the footage so you can see. It was just so so pretty. So what you're looking at is down in Cape Cod, Massachusetts. Not that I can remember the name of the town. Oh, Falmouth. <laughs> Falmouth, how could I forget that? Cape Cod, and this is sort of like a town landing or town harbor, and you know, Jay's just flying the drone and sharing it with you so you can see. Isn't it beautiful? What did you think of that ride, hun? I liked it. I really I enjoyed it. Yes. I was hoping we could get down to Provincetown and do the dunes. Oh yeah. That would have been really cool. Yeah. So I don't know if we'll be able to do that this year but it'd be kind of nice if we if we could take a take a trip down there it's really hard we have thanksgiving coming you know we've all sorts of different commitments and stuff that we have to do but if we go down to the dunes you know i'm going to have to go check out that place lady in the dunes she's a, a woman that has been murdered i don't know 47 years ago or something like that her body uh, you and your crime. was found you i know me my true crime right her body was found and um you know, finally she's been identified through DNA and through all of that. So, yeah, that spot is right there. I know exactly where it is. It's right outside that beach. So, the, the anyways. The tank is gone. What's gone? The military tank that used to be back there. Oh, oh, wow. Anyways, I'll probably film a little bit more when we get closer to our destination and, and share a little bit of our date night with you. I always like this corner because we're right behind a stupid car, but... They're probably doing the exact same thing that we're doing. 
enjoying a coastal ride. Because you really can't see much. I don't know, hopefully you can see a little bit. It's like the tide is in. The coast is so Oh, look at all the pumpkins. I'm surprised they're not all smashed. <laughs> They'll probably all be lit up see tonight. See all the mums going up and down the stairs? I've never seen it decorated like that before. Wow. It's a lot of money to... I guess they can afford it when you're crossing the ocean. I don't know why they have a big wide area here. And, they're and you no can't talk, stop. Mm -hmm. How many times have we stopped there anyways with Dad yeah. and Mom one time bringing them out here? Oh, more than once. Dad always liked it. Yep. Number That's of times. That's what he Number of times he came out here. I don't think they ever came out here on their own. No, I don't think so created beautiful memories bringing mom and dad out here especially dad because i think dad really liked it mom oh, probably yeah. didn't much care about it but dad liked it i know and you and i can't think of why somebody would not she's not him. an ocean lover no i know she hates the water and you know for us it's like it's just beautiful you know we love camping on the ocean Look at all these beautiful people out here walking enjoying Holding hands, that'll be us, honey, in a few years. Well, maybe be a little bit longer. We hold our hands. I know, but we hold hands all the time. Remember you used to be able to park here, too? Yep. Look at all the people. Oh, people on electric bikes, even. It's 77 degrees. November 5th, Christmas in about less than two months. I know, that's amazing. That is amazing. So we got a little bit of wind swept, but oh my gosh, that wind was so, so warm. It's like amazing. Is my hair all messed up? Your hair is all messed up, Tom. Oh no, I'll have to stop and fix it. I'll have to stop and fix it. I didn't, I, my lipstick is all worn off and you didn't even kiss me and my lipstick is worn off. <laughs> Usually when he kisses me, my lipstick gets worn off. He doesn't like it when I wear lipstick. Do you, honey? Do yeah, you poor thing. So, anyways, now we're gonna make our way to Newcastle. Well, we have to go through Portsmouth for it. No, well, yeah, we have to go through by the Wentworth by the sea. Yeah. Maybe I'll film going over that little bridge. Sure. This would be kind of sort of like a date night vlog. Now we're gonna be going over the the bridge, the marina. <laughs> this is very very exclusive area here. Look at all the boats out there. So cool. This there it's actually not very many boats up there at all right now, but that's a big sucker there. Yeah, that is a big one. There's the hotel. Very, very exclusive hotel. Little restaurant on the wharf there that we've gone to a couple of times. Really nice. Yeah, we gotta make a point to come back to that again. Yeah, we, we should stay here. Well, there's the, the uh cart with the pumpkins. We've taken pictures. This is in Newcastle, New Hampshire at Great Island Common. And this is just a really pretty park. We'd love to go here. But this is where we also spread Dad's ashes. So here we are. I love this spot, but oh my gosh. You know, memories. My sister and I were out in a boat way out there, way out there by the lighthouse when we said goodbye to Dad. So love coming here and saying, hi Dad, love ya. And now we're driving down through Portsmouth and Portsmouth is just a really pretty, they call it a port city and it it's amazing. It's very, very walk, walkable. There's all sorts of shops. When we arrived, we ended up parking and walked all along and watched and just did some people watching. We stopped at the bike shop where I drooled over one of the new bikes they have. I just absolutely love this color blue that you're going to see and not this one, but the next one. And um, I just really, blue green, sea green. I just love that color. I think it's amazing. And then we went over to the restaurant, Martin Gale Wharf and we overlooked the river and it was just amazing. The food was delicious. 
Thank you to Justin and Tamara for the wonderful gift certificate. I think we just sat there and we lingered over dinner and I think we were there for over two hours and watched the movie. Definitely shut up. Look at that. Yummy. And then we walked along the streets of Portsmouth. I love it at night like this. You can see the boats lit up and the church, the steeple, people out and about. It was such a wonderfully warm, mild evening. It was perfect. It was a perfect celebration for us, perfect date night. The night may have started off a little rocky with that accident, but it ended up being, for us anyways, just a beautiful evening together. Thank you so much for watching my date night vlog, and please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in my next video.